how to get more relevant Facebook fans with ads. We'll talk about that on today's video blog. Let's do it. Hey everybody, John here from JohnLumer.com and John Loomer Digital on Facebook here with a very popular topic. People ask me this every day. How can I get more fans? Now, here's the deal. Relevance is the key. So I'm gonna focus first on relevance and why you need to get relevant fans and build that relevant audience. Because here's the thing. You have countless marketers try to tell you that you can get fans for a penny a piece or some other crazy price. But you know what's gonna happen? They're gonna focus on specific countries that have a whole bunch of bots and fans and users who aren't gonna do any good for your business. They might also use some tricks to get more likes while those people might not actually be interested in your product or service. These things do you no good. It's extremely important that you focus on attracting an audience that'll bring you business. Seems obvious, right? So don't come crying to me. If you focus first on the number of fans over the quality, and you end up getting spammed like crazy and you don't actually get business out of your Facebook page. Okay, so let's talk about the Facebook ads tools that can lead to a relevant audience. First of all, just create a very simple Facebook page-like ad. The copy and the imagery, very important here, needs to appeal to your target audience. Ask for the like, if possible, offer something of value in exchange for the like that will appeal to that target audience and use a light-gated tab from a tool like ShortStack. Of course, the targeting of these ads will be very important. One tool you can use is called Custom Audiences. With Custom Audiences, you can target your offline customers on Facebook. So an example of this would be your email list or phone number list, feed that into Facebook, target those people who are on Facebook with ads, make sure you exclude those who are already fans, say, hey, you know me, like my page. Talk about relevance, that, my friends, is relevant. Once you've created that custom audience list, you can have Facebook find users who are similar to those who are on your email list with a tool called lookalike audiences. Target those people in ads. Another way you can target highly relevant people who are already familiar with you is by targeting those who have visited your website with a tool called website custom audiences. Once again, you'll focus on those who have visited your website but aren't currently fans. These ads basically say, hey, you read my blog, not like my Facebook page. Another way you can reach a highly relevant audience with your Facebook ads is through interest targeting. Target those who have specific interests, like certain pages that are very similar to those of your target audience. Now, a tool I recommend you use to achieve this list is Graph Search. You can run a graph search that essentially says, pages liked by people who like John Loomer Digital. You can also add another page to say pages liked by people who like John Loomer Digital and Social Media Examiner, making it highly relevant. You can also include interests and say interests liked by people who like John Loomer Digital and Social Media Examiner. Mix it up a little bit more. Pages liked by marketers who like John Loomer Digital and Social Media Examiner. Assemble this list. These are the pages and interests you'll be targeting within the interest area of your Facebook ad. For the greatest relevance, you can even mix it up a little bit. Target people who are on your look like audience list, but who also like relevant pages and interests. Another approach I recommend, though don't use this exclusively, is targeting friends of fans with these interests. Finally, when it comes to finding that relevant fan with Facebook ads, make sure you focus on relevant locations and ages. If you're a local business only, only focus on the area around your business. If your brand appeals only to an older demographic, don't waste your time and money on teenagers. Once again, you're gonna see variances in cost per page like based on country. Don't get too wrapped up in this because relevance is of utmost importance. Now when you run these campaigns, of course you're gonna to wanna to optimize. Now you're gonna be distracted by a lot of metrics like cost per click, CPM, and click-through rate. Don't really pay much attention to those. I want you to use the Facebook ad reports, focus on cost per page like, and then break it down by placement, age, gender, and country. Okay, finally, how much is this gonna cost? 
Well, you've gotten past the fact that it's gonna cost more than a penny per page like. You want relevance. So, now it really depends on the countries you're targeting, again, making sure they're relevant, the niche and industry that you're in. Because quite frankly, if you're like, hey, like my pizza, lots more people are gonna like that than if, say you're in the healthcare industry if you're an attorney. So in general, I like to say it's gonna be anywhere between 20 cents per page like and a dollar. In the really challenging industries, it might be more than a dollar. If you're a really well-known brand, a page that's easy to like, could be under 20 cents. Okay, that's it for building a highly relevant Facebook audience with ads. Now, I mentioned a lot of tools in here that I didn't go into a lot of detail on. I've listed blog posts in the description with full tutorials to help you out. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Check me out on Facebook, John Loomer Digital. And make sure you read my blog at johnloomer.com. Until next time, do awesome things. I'm out.